Fall Army Worm arrived in Africa about two, two and a half years ago, uh, but it has quickly spread uh, across the sub-Saharan uh, Africa, and it's now in virtually all countries and tens of millions of hectares of maize and also reports of sorghum and millet being infested. Um, and it continues to spread into new areas. It continues to move north. We're getting more reports of it moving further north into Sudan, for example, um, which is also obviously of concern because it could continue to spread even uh, here into Europe and to the Middle East, um, on, into other parts of the world, into Asia, etc. Nuru is a new digital assistant uh, which will provide advice to farmers on how to manage fall armyworm in sub-Saharan Africa. Nuru is, uh, will be available on digital phones, smartphones, as a complement to an existing system that FAO launched about three months ago called the Fall Army Worm Monitoring and Early Warning System, which is an application uh, which farmers, extensionists, anybody in the field who's registered can put data in about levels of infestation of fall armyworm in the field, as well as adults from traps. But now Nuru, um, a new complement to that, is a new assistant, a digital assistant, that Penn State University, uh, we've worked with them very closely to develop, and this new uh, assistant will be able to respond to farmers directly. So not only will farmers be able to send data to a global system, national system, global system, but also get advice about how to manage fall armyworm. So she will talk, Nuru, uh, she'll talk to the farmer in local languages. Right now she knows about four languages well, but she'll learn many more through machine learning and be able to talk to farmers, understand their voice command questions, and respond to them in their local languages. The good news is that you don't have to be online. You don't have to be using phone service data. It's all contained in your phone. This is an open access platform that anyone who registers can use the system. In fact, we're encouraging, and we would love to have as many users as possible, because obviously that will both send data back to us um, and to the national governments to be able to monitor at a national level, farm room, but also provide the assistance to as many farmers, extensionists, uh, workers in the field as possible.